It just reminds us of who we are and where we came from. Silver Inn Restaurant's famous Chinese food was cherished in Calgary for decades. But the family who runs it announced its closure last month, holding its last night of service on Sunday. But now they're grappling with the theft of their sign. The sign was with the restaurant and family for over 45 years and was stolen this weekend. The only surviving piece of things that we have that dated back to that day. The closure of Silver Inn is still fresh. Their cooks just beginning to shut down the kitchen for good as the family adjusts to a silent dining room and no phones ringing off the hook for reservations. The sign, which they believe was taken on Monday between 12 and 1 p.m., is not worth much monetarily, but holds sentimental value and has struck a chord at this fragile time. We were prepared to deal with the emotion, with saying goodbyes to a lot of uh, friends that we met over the years. I never thought that I would get upset over a stupid sign. It kind of hit you. The restaurant has been operating in Calgary since 1975, moving to Center Street Northeast in July of 1978. Their claim to fame? Creating ginger beef itself. People will munch on these and uh, drink more beer. And that was the whole intent behind it. And I really know well, how successful it is, but you know, but I guess it took off from there. The decision to close was a difficult one. Kwong Chung, who is now 67, says it became a seven day a week job. It was time to walk away, and no family member decided to take it over. Since the announcement, the phone has been ringing off the hook. They had to stop taking reservations. Chung says the most special thing for him, the loyalty from their customers. If I talk about that, it uh, chokes me up. Uh, it's a kid that go up that hits me, yeah. As for the stolen sign, it's been reported to police in hopes they'll be reunited with it once again. In Calgary, Taylor Broad, City News.